Yo, clown on me. I'm back again. Like it wasn't enough, I did 44 hours streaming over Christmas and New Year. We're back once again. It's the incredible D4 damaging power to the people. The Astro Clown is back once again. We are here today to do the collab special. Yo! Hey! One of my favourite sets from Clown Fest in your ear holes right now. Matthias Soccer, the man who delivered that distortion pedal to me, the little yellow one at the back there. Oh yeah! All names are in the hat. All names are in the hat. All new names. 24 people, which means another 12 pairings coming up. <laughs> so I haven't really thought about what the fuck I'm going to do for this show, like, at all. Um, but yeah, I'm going to pick some more names out of the hat. We're going to recap Climb Fest a little bit. Fuck me, the view numbers! YouTube started generating um, Clangfest on day five for home screens. Fuck me! Thank you, YouTube. Thank you, everybody who took part in that. Thank you, everybody who liked the stream. Everybody who commented on the stream. Because that's how YouTube uh, generate their, their, their listings and stuff. Fuck me, look at this view count. Look at this view count. We started here, and I expected this one to be a little bit lower number. 679, I'm happy with that. A thousand views, a thousand views, a thousand views. And then day five kicked off, we got 2.4 there, 5.2 there, 4.8 there, and it carried on for day six. 5.4 there, oh my god. Oh my god. Like, like, I knew the bubble was going to burst at some point and we were going to be put on YouTube's, like, front page, but, uh, you know, I wasn't expecting it over Clangfest. And fuck me, the numbers are amazing. I'm hoping we're going to get a little bit of a trickle down to the other ones as well, because that they deserve it. Every set was fucking on point. Everybody leveled up. Matthias Socket here, this is the first time he's done live drum and bass. Fuck me, this blew my socks off. Jesus Christ. Good evening to everybody we have in the show already. Mind Me Palatian, Cy Murphy, Maudio, Yellow, Technox, the Tech, the, uh, the Android, I'm calling you Android. RIP Records, Bad Badger. Who else we got in the show? That's it for now. I'm sure more people will turn up later. I bet you didn't think I was going to stream. I had to. We didn't get everybody for the collab special sorted, so I thought it was best if I do another one. Because uh, we had to run on time for, for New Year's Eve to finish at 12. And we did! And it was fucking glorious! Else is in the chat? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh boy, and have we got things coming up for, the, for, the, for this year? Have we got things coming up for this year? We're already talking about a URL on tour. And we're talking France, um, Holland, uh, Germany. We're going all over. Matthias Soccer absolutely fucking smashing it out. An amazing DMB set. Amazing DMB set. So, shall we just recap Cap Clown Fest? Six days of streaming. 125 artists. 44 hours worth of streaming. And nearly 20,000 views to those six days. 20,000 views. You should all be very proud of the sets you put in because each and every one was fucking amazing. Like, like, oh, just, my mind was blown. Like, I say this every time. Everybody levels up at Clownfest. But, like, this time it felt like you leveled up by 10. And I'm talking everyone.
Yes, mind manipulation. Round of applause for everybody who took part in Clownfest. Everybody. And that that's the hosts, me and Tim. Uh, that is the uh, artists that put in. Oh, 125 of them, and everybody in the chat comments. It's your, it's you guys in the chat comments that generate YouTube's um, interest in it. So fuck me, we all did well over Clownfest. We all did well over Clownfest. I literally, my flabber is gassed about how good it was. Oh, it feels weird doing a stream on a Tuesday and not going, oh, let's get into the show. <laughs> I guess the show tonight is is me pulling, pulling names out of a hat. So I'm going to take a sip of coffee. Because I haven't had a chance to scratch my... Literally, I've just jumped out of the bath. I haven't had a chance to scratch my fucking ass today. Is this day seven? Yeah, technically it is day seven. <laughs> this is only going to be a short stream. Uh, I don't intend to, be, uh, intend to be on here very long. I just want to get the last of the pairings out. Uh, and, and see where we go from there, really. Do you have a favourite from Clownfest? My top five, my top five from Clownfest are, and this is really self-indulgent, really, really self-indulgent. One of my fav my, f my favorite set from Clownfest is mine. Which is really fucking selfish. Then Charlie Ryan, then Matthias Soccer, then Gorgeous Roy, and then uh, Dementor. My top five from Clownfest. If you have a top top five, please let me know. All sets are going up to my client, to my YouTube page. I've just got to the end of day three. Uh, I will start day four tomorrow. Uh, so yeah, like take a look through them. Decide which one you think was your favorite because it's all down to personal choice at the end of the day. It literally is down to personal choice. But yeah, m my set, Charlie's set, Matthias Soccer's set, uh, Gorgeous Roy, and uh, and Dementor. My top five. Fucking everybody knocked it out of the park. Everybody knocked it out of the park. Big love and been big thank you to everybody that has been involved in the Clown Army for the past seven years. You are all beautiful people and I love you with every aching ounce of love that I have in my broken black little fucking heart. Thank you so much for, be for being a part of Clown Army. Thank you so much for being a part part of clan army point two's just joined us go on my son how's it going down there in tasmania right i'm gonna get on with pulling the names out of the hat because that's primarily what we are here for this evening i'm gonna let matthias soccer play in the background because as far as i'm concerned one of the greatest sets of clan quest really really was so Shall we get into the whole reason of why we are here this evening? I need a piece of paper in front of me so that I can write this down. There are 24 people in the hat. Some of them have literally just joined Clownfest as well. I'm like, yeah, fuck it. I'll, I'll, I'll go in for that, which is absolutely brilliant. War Minstrel in the building. And I hear the War Minstrel and Yellow are already collabing. Uh, Yellow's like, oh, March inspired me to do a little mini rig, so here's my mini rig, and collabing with the War Minstrel has been amazing. You have got a perfect partner there, Yellow. I'm not even joking. Yes, the android, you are new, and your name is in the hat. My girlfriend's name is also in the hat. Shall we start? Shall we start? I just need to turn the studio down a bit. Only the mastering to do now? Warren, you're kidding. You've already collabed. We only sorted this out a couple of days ago. Fuck me. I mean, I know you're quick, fella, but Jesus Christ. Are we ready? Are we ready? Name number one coming out of the hat. Okay, here we go. Powerpuff Girls hat. Magic Powerpuff Girls hat. Right, so this is probably going to take about 15 minutes to do. Sticks is up first. Okay. Sticks. Sticks is taking on. Very good producer, Sticks. Been in the army for fucking forever. All right, who's up next? Who's taking on Sticks? Oh, oh, oh! Sticks, you got a, you got a heavy hitter, Mindy Techno. 
get in sticks. Good fucking, that's going to be amazing. You both write techno, you both write good techno. Hey Jordan, how's it going? Okay, who is up next? One down, 12 more pairings to go. Okay, so this is a pairing that wanted to be paired up together. Troll Mamamo versus Jaguardini. They come from the same place and I thought, screw it, let's, let's have them. So, Trauma Mammal versus Jaguardini, they wanted to be paired up. I know that's kind of cheating, but hey, you know, that is what it is. It is what it is. Right, so who's next? Mr. Chris, and I know he wanted to collab with um, Sticks. Mr. Chris versus... Again, this is all random. I am not, I'm not cheating in any way. Uh, this is how it comes out of the hat and this is how I prefer to do it. The Android! I can't pronounce, I can't say your first name just yet. Give me six months and I might get it right. Okay, so the Android is teamed up with Mr. Chris. Mr. Chris writes some fucking brutal stuff, mate. We're calling it Redneck Techno. It's brilliant. You are going to have a good time there. You're in good hands, my man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mr. Chris. He's usually... No, he's not on tonight. I haven't seen his name, but I will get you paired up with him. Don't worry. I'm going to put all the pairings in the, the, the comments on this, on this video, so you can all go back to it. Okay, Janice... No. Janice... Enderles. Okay, he's a new guy to the to the the thing, but I know who he is, and he was promoted to me by Mindy, I think. Okay, so that's a newcomer. Let's see who you've got. <laughs> Redneck robot techno. I can't think of anything else. No, Jordan, it is not. Oh, another new one, Darren Gilbert. Now I know who this is. Hold on, who is, who is that? AKA. I'm sure, I put. Oh yeah, that's that's Goods. Yes, he joined us for uh, on day three, I think. Okay. Oh, lost the top of my pen. We are four down. We are four down. Here is the next pairing. Adam Crawford is still in the heart. Dog Ice is still in the heart. Who else is still in the heart? Elsa is still in the heart. Finger Wolf! Finger Wolf is taking on. Bellem Gates. Uh, they did tell me how to pronounce that, but I can't remember how to do it. He played a blinding opening set for uh, for Climbfest. Right, we are five down, almost halfway. No, Elsa, we will not leave you in the hat. Oh, okay, okay, so this young lady put in a track to the URL for the Clankfest URL, Colt 303, went down so well, and agreed to do the, uh, the challenge. So, Colt 303. Okay, who are you working with? Ah, can't get it open. Alan Crawford. So, Scottish Techno takes on Colt 303. That should be interesting. Alan's got lovely melodies. Colt 303's got lovely 303 lines. I think that's going to be a match made in heaven. Ben Clark, up next. Ben 
Oh, there's an A on the end of Clark. Ben Clark, who I remixed one of his tracks and he opened his set with it. Ah, uh, come on, next name. Get it open, get it open, get it open, get it open. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, so uh, Simon Clement, Clement Hughes, I believe that is. That should be that should be a great work in. Uh, uh, Simon has been in the, in the army for as long as I can remember, and it's taken him seven years to do something. Uh, and he did a set, uh, Colonel Klein, uh, and smashed it out of the park. Really did beautiful modular stuff. So I hope that beautiful modular is going to meet Ben Clark's uh, uh, guitar riffs, and it's going to be absolutely fucking beautiful. Absolutely fucking beautiful. Okay, who's next? Oh, the mighty dog house. Okay, the mighty dog house is with. I'd like to pair Elsa up with Dog Eggs, I really would. Oh, okay, Gary Baxter. Gary Baxter did a, a blinded set for Kindfest this time around, and he was like, I feel like a fraud, I don't really put into the URL. That's not the point, mate, that's not the point. What you do do is turn up with a fucking spanking set when, when it is required, and that's what you want. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Four left. All right. Cy Murphy. Cy Murphy versus... Interesting. Oh, the man from LA. Or is it New York? Syntax era. Awesome set again. I think those two are going to get on really, really well. They both love uh, electronic kind of, you know, old uh, uh, 80s, 90s hip hop kind of stuff. Electronica should go down really, really well. Yeah, sorry Murphy, you're with Syntax Era. Um, uh, Elsa wanted to be put in the hat like everybody else, which, you know, I can't blame her for doing. She's like, don't, don't bend the rules for me. Oh, you were one away, Elsa. You were one away. Who we got? Oh, oh, yes! Oh, Helia, good friend, and a URL from his place. That's going to be spanking. That is going to be spanking. So, Paul Helia, you are teamed up with my girlfriend. That is going to be spanking. Sassy Floof Kava. Sassy Floof versus... Sudden Creation. That should be interesting. That should be very interesting. Who we got? Who we got? Oh! My first soccer set has just finished. Let me just grab another one. 
from the uh, collection. Hold on two sacks. Let's go for... Ah. Mm okay. Let's go for a bit of liquid neck. Okay. Pulled this name out of the hat, I think, before we did that. Okay, Cleonis Belcher. Interesting. 303 Bill. That should be that should be well weird. Bill did some sort of drill set that that just uh, permeated my brain. It was it was insane. Okay, Cleonos's Belcher's son. I can't remember her name now. And that is the last in the hat. Just to prove that it is a hat. Malakar, Malakit. And you are a uh, blip for time. Blip, blip for time. Okay, we have all of the pairings for Climb Fest. Another 12 to add to the 34, I think that was already there. 12, 34, uh, no, 34, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, 5, 5, 6, 47. 47 pairings. Now, the reason I did so many is because not everybody is going to get it in. But um, uh, 40, 47 pairings should be enough to be able to get this done. We now have three pages of people that will be working together. Right, you know the assignment. I'm go just going to run through the rules on this one. So let's just give Nick a break a minute. I'm just going to run through the rules on this one. Basically, the rules are, you have to work with somebody and produce a track. That is it. You have until the second week in March to get it done. Uh, and, uh, th yeah, there are rules. You've got to work with the person that you've been uh, allocated with. You can, do, you can do whatever track you want, it, uh, whatever style you like, whatever BPM, whatever anything. Just, like, whatever you two... You, uh, pairings decide to do is is entirely fine by me. Doesn't matter how long the track is, doesn't matter what style the track is, the only thing uh, you need to do is have it ready for the second week in March. Ah yes, the Android. Hopefully I can find time to do my collab considering I'm finishing my last semester of college. You'll be fine fella, you'll be fine. Who are you paired up with? Who are you paired up with? The Andrew, uh, Mr. S Mr. Chris. All you need to do is grab some samples, chuck them over to Mr. Chris, and I'm pretty sure he'll be, he'll be able to do the bulk of the work. The guy is a genius. I'm not joking you, yeah? Should be fine. Absolutely should be fine. So, the rules are, work with your partner. Don't care style. Don't care BPM. Don't care all the rest of it. Don't care the genre. You know, uh, just have it ready for the second week in, um, uh, in March. All should be fine. Oh yeah, absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. And th this is kind of kind of the thing because a lot of people work with each other because because they know them or they're happy working with them or something. This is a step outside the comfort zone of I know I I know who I'm working with. This is a step of I've no idea who I'm working with. I've no idea what I'm going to do. I've got no idea. Blah 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 blah. And it should be fine. Just like learn as much as you can from the person that you're with is 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 what. What I would say to you, uh, but yeah, I will do a post about it, uh, a third one because we've already done two, and I will put all the pairings and names in the description of this comments section so everybody can uh, can have a reference point to where it is because I know not everybody is on 
Facebook, uh, and not everybody is on YouTube. So hopefully, if we've got both base bases covered, then everybody should know who they're working with. Uh, I'm also going to open a group chat on Facebook. Uh, for those of you not on Facebook, I'll pass information on between the two that needs the information. Uh, and that's that's a, that literally that literally is is it. Like just just. Whoever you're working with, work with them well, learn a little bit from them. Oh, yeah. And the, uh, the whole reason we're doing this is to put it here. The Client Army Bandcamp. We have three releases on uh, on there at the moment. Uh, the Songs to Mutiny 2, uh, In Acid We Trust, and The Lost Tracks from Unhinged Filth. This is drum and bass, this is techno, this is hardcore, like fucking hardcore. So yeah, once you've done your tracks, we'll slap them over there and that will pay for the .live site, which Jim Prendergast um, uh, has funded for the past three years. Here is the, uh, here is the .live site. And there's, there's so much here, there really is. So here is a list of all the people that have ever played Clownfest. There's like 150 names there. And more will get added to that uh, momentarily. There we go. So there's the Clownfest.live site. There you can find the stream and there's bits and pieces and there's Clownfest and the lineups and Spew, which is talking about different artists and stuff so that there are lo there's loads of stuff going on here the URL just a little bit of a blurb about the URL there the shout out posts go up here there we go <clears throat> shout out post posts go up here and there's just bags and bags and bags of music just right there you know if you're ever bored go looking through that uh, as I said the clowns Dusted is is old is, is the uh, the old the rest of the clown fests that does need um, uh, updating a little bit uh, old flyers and then the merch page where you can find the merch so yeah that's what that's for uh, and so yeah so yeah get your collab uh, partner uh, do see do with your collab partner and uh, and see what you can come up with. Uh, no holds barred, any genre you like, just discuss it between the two of you and find out what it is that it is that it is that you guys want to do. Right. I am going to end this evening, I think. Uh, I don't think I need to recap Clangfest anymore. I think I've kind of said that it was it was the best Clangfest ever. Everybody pulled out all the stops to make it fucking amazing. Uh, uh, we got more views to this one than we uh, have have got to like a lot of the other ones, which is fucking amazing. Uh, I th I want to thank everybody that was involved in it. Uh, there's, you know, I mean, it was just amazing. <laughs> Elsa says, I can't believe you haven't played Granny's Fannies in 2024. Not yet, but it might happen tonight. You never know, because uh, I was going to end this evening with a little bit of a set, ladies and gentlemen. I enjoyed my set at Clangfest so much that I think I should do another one. Don't you think I should do another one? I think you should do another one. Right, so I'm going to go quiet for the next couple of minutes whilst I sort out uh, everything. And I will, I will be back in your ear holes in about two seconds.
shut up and drive. Shut up. Shut up and drive.
is the last one and it's a good old favorite of mine and mark's and uh, everybody's by the sounds of it you dirty bastards uh and it's um a bit of a techno touch on uh, the old granny's fannies so let's take it away Fanny 
Be a bit dry and you'll have to spit on it, but yeah. Might be a bit dry and you'll have to spit on it, but yeah. set the standard there and I hope the rest of this festival is a lot fucking better musically and content wise than what we have witnessed here in this last 15-20 minutes because that was horrendous and if I have offended anybody, then you can fuck off because I don't care. Enjoy! Extravaganza of techno by a gay club owner from the north of England <coughs> who likes pigeons, greyhounds, gambling, women, men, boys, and anything with a hole. So, uh, thank you for listening. Goodbye.